You know, at first it may seem strange that you can only get Minecraft Bedrock on a Windows computer. That is, until you realise that Minecraft is owned by Microsoft, and of course they're going to lock it into their own operating system. That's why it's lucky for Linux users that this exists. MCP Launcher. This project, kind of like the project I made a video on previously, which allowed you to download both Roblox Player and Studio on Linux, allows you to download Minecraft Bedrock on Linux. So, let's get started. Now, I should probably tell you how this actually works first. This basically just downloads the Android app and lets you use that. Meaning, if you haven't bought the Android app, you won't be able to do this. Now, luckily, Minecraft on Android isn't that expensive. I think it's around $8 if you don't have it already. If you haven't already set up Flatpak, which I will link in the description, to find out how to install it for your distro. I'm on Ubuntu, and for the purposes of this tutorial, I'll just assume that you're on a Debian-based distro as well. So I'll open my terminal. And if I didn't already have Flatpak installed, I'd do sudo apt install Flatpak. And obviously I'd say yes when it prompted me to, and it'd be installed. Simple. When we have Flatpak installed, execute this command. Now we're done. All we have to do now is this command. Now here, this has opened this window. Just press continue here and sign in with your Google account. Obviously this goes without saying, but make sure it's the Google account that you actually own Minecraft on. This is optional, but you can provide a password to open the launcher and protect your Google credentials if you want. I'm not going to bother and I'm just going to save and complete login. Now from here, this pretty much works how you'd expect if you're familiar with the Java Edition launcher. And the cool thing about this as well is that you can download different versions. I'm just going to stick with the latest version for now though, and then download and play. While that's downloading, it should be worth mentioning that while you can run that command to run this every time you want to play Minecraft, you don't have to do that. For me, because I'm on Ubuntu, I can just search for apps, search of Minecraft, and it's this Minecraft Bedrock here. Ignore that, that's from something different. If it doesn't show up on your start menu, restart your computer and then it should do. Obviously now I can sign in with my Microsoft account, which I will do because I want to access multiplayer. Now I have full access to Minecraft Bedrock Edition on Linux. Don't worry about this, this is just something that will come up because you're not actually on Android, but it thinks you are. I want to make sure that I can use multiplayer because it allows me to join my server. Being able to join my server for me is quite important, especially joining my test servers and servers that I'm testing out plugins that I make on because my server is cross-play. I have to use Bedrock accounts to test my server and different plugins quite a lot. So before I'd have to just use my phone or even worse, sometimes switch to Windows, which are both kind of time consuming. If you're a plugin dev like I am, hopefully this will save you some time. And funnily enough, I also know another time saving technique for plugin devs.